President Biden has announced an award of 2.8 billion dollars in grants in a bid to boost production of electric vehicle batteries in the United States. The move is also aimed at reducing the country's reliance on Chinese supplies. The grants will be used to build and expand domestic manufacturing of batteries for electric cars in 12 states of the United States. A total of 20 companies will receive grants for projects to extract and process battery materials like lithium and graphite and strengthen the U.S. supply of critical minerals required for making electronic vehicles. The announcement comes as the Biden administration seeks to boost production and sales of electric vehicles. I'm seeing a challenge, but we see an opportunity, a real opportunity, to shift to a net zero sum carbon world in one of the most significant economic transitions since the Industrial Revolution. That's not hyperbole, that's a fact. We're also confronting it head on with American ingenuity and American jobs. It is a key part of Biden's strategy to slow down climate change and push U.S. manufacturing. The federal grants are funded by last year's infrastructure law worth $1 trillion. The legislation is also tied to the Inflation Reduction Act that Biden signed back in August, which offers several provisions to boost electric vehicles, including tax credits for EV buyers worth up to $7,500. Biden wants 50% of all new vehicles sold in the United States to be either electric or plug-in hybrid electric models by the year 2030. He also aims to install 500,000 new EV charging stations. Biden, however, has not endorsed the phasing out of the new gasoline-powered vehicle sales by 2030. This is critically important because the future of vehicles is electric. But the battery is a key part of that electric vehicle. And right now, 75 percent, as the folks on the screen can tell you, 75 percent of that battery manufacturing is done in China. The White House says that the United States and allies do not produce enough of the critical minerals and materials that are used in EV batteries. In March, Biden invoked the Defense Production Act to support the production and processing of minerals and materials used for electronic vehicle batteries. The new grants are expected to dramatically increase electric vehicle sales in the United States by 2030. But even at the start of the next decade, they will amount to just over one-third of new vehicle sales in America. Beyond World is One is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news updates on the move.